Okay, um, watch this. <laughs> I thought this was really funny. Um, there's a skill point in this area, and in order to get it, you have to land on the little pedestal there. Now, I was, okay, I don't know if I was bored or what, but I decided to try and do it while the thief was on there, which sounds really stupid. But I thought maybe I could get rid of them just before landing, you know, if I hovered at the right time. Now, I did that, and this happened. Moonwalk. What a sad excuse for one. But yeah, I seriously thought I lost a life when that happened, but I didn't. So yeah, that was awesome. Now, watch this. Uh, I hope I can do this right. Got him! Yes! Oh, man. Yeah. I, uh... Yeah, like I said, I don't know if I was just bored or what. I really don't know how I discovered that. Pure accident. But remember when I said this was a throwback to the old spiral? Remember the red and yellow thieves from Molten Crater? Well, here we have red and yellow thieves once again, just like treetops. And we're supercharging. Only this time we're supercharging after both thieves. Just like in treetops. I guess the only real difference is the fact that we don't have to go through outrageous heights just to get to them. But hey, we're done. <laughs> yeah, I thought that was really funny when I did that. And you know what? I never did get that skill point. I had to... Uh, well, I don't need it. This game's not that hard. But... Basically, once that thief is gone, all you have to do is just glide to the pedestal and uh, just land on it. That's all you have to do. Now, uh, that portal right there leads to Enchanted Towers. Now, it's one of the first portals in the uh, home world. I believe it's the first one listed in the Atlas. But I don't recommend going there until you free Sergeant Bird. Ah, my good. What a sucker, uh, that is. Oh, you heard that, right? He called me a sucker. But yeah, free Sergeant Bird first, because there's an area in there. Well, actually, it's not an area. It's just part of it that you have to play with him. Sergeant Bird, 9068. Awaiting orders, sir. Uh, I think you'll have to find your commanding officer for that. Hey, what are those things? These are the latest military hardware. DBX-9 rocket launchers, state of the art. So why did you use them to escape? Because, because I have limited ammo, and I wanted to conserve it. For this. <laughs> Say, where'd you come from? I thought dragons had all been dead for a thousand years or something. Well, the rumors of our extinction were slightly exaggerated. We just wanted a little peace and quiet. Well, if it's peace and quiet you want, you should stay clear of my homeworld for a bit. I reckon I'll be blowing up Rhinox for weeks. Cheerio! So yeah, that was Sergeant Bird. Also played by Tom Kenny. I think I've mentioned that already. But yeah, that... What he did to Moneybags, yeah, he deserved that. <laughs> Wait till you see what Bentley did to him. But yeah, I recommend clearing out his base first. Because part of Enchanted Towers has to be done by him. There are gems in that portal that Spyro can't reach. 
and part of a mission that only he can accomplish. Spyro can do part of it, but he actually needs Sergeant Bird to do the rest. Now, uh, this is basically the same as she was out. Come in and get through the exit. Get to the exit, rather. But in the meantime, we have to rescue these five hummingbirds. Now, uh, remember when I said I was okay with Sheila? It was the other ones that I didn't much care for? Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> you probably would expect me to be like, oh, I know I said I didn't care for the other characters. I, I changed my mind. No. <laughs> I stand by what I said. Sheila, I'm okay with. But, uh, well, I mean, it's, it's not like I don't like playing with the other characters. It's just I prefer the original guy. <laughs> if that makes sense. Maybe I just spent too much time with Spyro. I don't know. Okay, now there's another skill point in here as well. If I can uh, get him to come out. There we go. There. You have to shoot all the gophers. It's funny, uh, in another area, you see the exact same animal, and they're considered moles. <laughs> 